What is the definition of fairness? It is one everyone has the same opportunity to achieve what they want. It is basically equality. What is the definition of well-being? It is when a complex combination of person, physical, mentally, emotion, and social health factor. Well-being is strongly linked to happiness and life pacification. In short, answer well-being could be described as how you feel about yourself and your life. What is the definition of of unhealthy, being sick or deprived, 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 depressed, depressed. Now you show up. Yes. <laughs> How can I measure the improvement of the quality of people and teenagers' lives? By asking myself if I like today more than yesterday. You sure? Good. Good. Am I totally responsible for my for the quality of my life? Oh, okay. In the long run, we shape our life and we shape ourselves. The purpose never ends until we die, and the choices we make are ultimately our own responsibility. In short, answer. Yes. Okay. That's good. How is bullying created? Bullying can be created when a person is jealous of someone else. So in order to make themselves feel better, the person bully others. Bullying is created when someone continuously abuses a person he she doesn't like. On purpose, this can occur physically, socially, mentally or psychologically. Tips on how to create fairness. There are a numerous amount of tips on how to create fairness. But in short answer, treat people the way you want to be treated. Consequences of teenager after being bullied. <coughs> bullying can affect everyone. Those who are bullied, those who bully, and those who witness bullying. Bullying is linked to many negative outcomes, including impacts on mental health, depression, and even suicide. Over 3.2 million students are victims of bullying each year. One in ten students drop out of school because of repeated bullying. Over 67% of students believe that schools respond poorly to bullying, with a high percentage of students believing that adult help is infrequent and ineffective. One in four teachers see nothing wrong with bullying and will only intervene 4% of the time. The one with the glasses is the bully. So how do you stop bullying? Well, you need to be confident. You have to create distance from the bully. Here comes the teacher. Teacher should always intervene. So, William? Yep. Have you ever been bullied? Yep. Well, what do you do for revenge? Oh, I just gave him a very gentle punch. Mm, yeah. And what happened after that? Um, um, there was a huge bruise on his shoulder, and he went to the clinic, and the staff told him that he needed to put some cream on it for two weeks. Well, do you think that was a good idea? <laughs> um. It's and it's coming, and it's faster than an airplane. You can try, keep on running, but no one can die.